at this moment he should be happy he should be happy the fans are not around he know the Highlanders fans are demanding and uh, this should be a great time for him to to get the fans on his side in terms of uh, his positioning do you think uh, uh, coach uh, Mantla will be happy with the way he has uh, uh, positioned himself. Yeah, when you're a striker and you're getting those chances, it, uh, it, 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 as those are signs to show that you are getting in the right positions. And he's been doing that uh, the, the whole of this game. Wukosi. Mpelele. Ndazi's points to the spot. And uh, Ndazi doesn't hesitate when it comes uh, to penalty decisions. And it looks like they are giving it to their captain, Erel Sibanda. Navaya, Douglas tackling. We're just talking about the positioning of. Uh, Navaya, the fact that anything can happen in the box. Douglas feeling it's a harsh decision. And the RL Sibanda he scored uh, four league goals um, last uh, time around in the league in 2019. We'll be taking the penalty. Yeah, great positioning by, by Navaya. Like I just said, he's always there in the box, creating problem for defense. And uh, now he's got uh, a resulted penalty for his efforts. And if you look at Douglas uh, Spanda, that'll be uh, a disappointment for him. Because if you look at the time right now, with eight minutes to go and you concede the penalty, it becomes a, a really torrid time for the team. As of uh, yesterday, uh, coming into Sunday matches in uh, the Chibuku Super Cup uh, 2021, of uh, the 61 goals uh, scored, uh, four had been uh, scored uh, from the spot. And uh, here is a chance for Ariel uh, to get yet another one from the spot. He's just uh, taking his uh, time. He scored four, by the way, in the league for Highlanders in 2019. Uh, from uh, the penalty uh, spot and there was uh, three goals uh, shy of uh, the top goal scorer uh, in terms of the league goals the man who is in tanzania uh, prince Dube. of course the prince has scored uh, seven in the league plus four in the chibuku super cup and he has been doing very well in tanzania this time ariel has an opportunity to score and a big moment as well for begging people he has been on top of his game he has a chance to continue shining. Yeah, a, a great chance for him to to step up and uh, and keep the, the scores level. But you're yeah, going against an experienced footballer in aerial Spanda and expecting penalty kicks uh, with some mind games going on there. He would want to create the pressure on uh, Ariel Sibanda. That is uh, Begin Pilongobe. It's part of the game. Uh, Begin Pilongobe has done well. He would want to maintain that. And uh, he is indicating that uh, he would want it by uh, the center of the spot. And uh, he would want to touch the ball as well. Ariel making sure that um, he doesn't touch the ball. I wonder what will be happening and <laughs> what the belief will be there just to avoid him uh, touching the ball before he takes the penalty, especially having gone to the bench uh, before uh, that uh, penalty was taken. So Ariel Sibanda has a chance then uh, to uh, give Highlanders uh, the lead in this match very late as well uh, into the match. He's uh, so close as well uh, to the ball. Uh, that is uh, Ariel Sibanda facing Volaya City goalkeeper, uh, Begimpilo Nube, who has done very well 
Uh, so far in uh, this match, can he uh, keep shining and uh, deny Ariel Sibandam uh, from the sport? Let's go, says Ndazi. Here is Ariel. He converts. It's, he is the first caller for the season. It's on the Highlanders' second uh, goal in the Chibuku Super Cup 2021. Fine strike from the men they call Umangoye. And if they pick the three points, it will be a big three points for Highlanders coming from that industrial action. Yeah, Ariel taking his time and... Uh...